today I'm going to show you the contents of the PME cake steamer. This comes fully boxed with operation instructions and if we just move over to the actual steamer itself you can see we have the vapour release across the top here. We have the on off switch adjust to the back which clicks on and off and we have the lock and unlock at the top and you just literally twist this in a clockwise motion and if I undo that you can see there are two recesses there to re-clip, slot in and twist back to the front again. This is also available in a UK and EU and USA plug and the level indicator on the side shows you the minimum and maximum levels that this can take. This will hold 140 mils of water and the power wattage on this is 800 and it takes approximately one minute to heat to the temperature required for use. Now I'm going to show you how to use the cake steamer. So make sure that you twist it in a clockwise motion to undo the vapour release section of your cake steamer and I'm going to fill this to the maximum level with distilled water which I've pre-measured out and then I'm going to reattach the vapour release by just aligning the two sections here on the top part and the lower section line those up and twist back again to lock. Now before you use this for the first time make sure that you boil and then throw away that water. I've also plugged this in now as well at the wall before I've switched it on and this should take about 60 seconds to actually reach to the required temperature for the steam to actually come from the vapour release section of the cake steamer. Now this is what we're going to be using to remove excess icing sugar off your cakes on the outside and also what we'll use to freshen up any display cakes or flowers that you may have. You'll also be able to give a natural shine and glaze and seal and set powdered colours onto flowers and leaves etc. So once that's actually reached its required temperature we can then slide towards our cake tip if you need to just slightly and instantly remove any excess icing sugar that may be on your cake just by lightly moving that across the surface of the cake and that's as simple as that. Switch it off when you're finished. Make sure that you throw away any excess water that's left remaining inside the tank and make sure that you don't repackage this until it's cooled down so probably a minimum of five minutes to be able to let that happen. And also to remove dust and dirt off display cakes and also roses and flowers and foliage as well. 